Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Well, this video is all about giving you guys the current beer bar prices. And not only the price of the drinks, all of the prices. Uh, because so many of you guys have asked for this after the popularity of the previous videos on the dancing bars. We're going to visit and get prices on 10 beer bars. And the first one is Ammon's Bar, which is a very traditional beer bar. Hi. Hi. Just uh, have a soda. Soda. Soda Nam Cheng Mana. Soda Nam Cheng Mana. Yeah. Ooh. Now you saw the prices there at Ammon's Bar. Uh, those are about the cheapest prices you're going to get in, in any decent place in the whole of Patia. Uh, you're not going to get much cheaper than that. So we're going to walk down now, uh, this is Sawyer Pothole, we'll walk down to David from Chicago's bar, uh, the Backyard Bar, and we'll have a chat to him about uh, prices. Uh, in the meantime, I just want to explain a couple of things to you. Um, <coughs> these beer bar prices seem to fall into three categories. There's the traditional beer bar, which does not have any working girls, and is just cheap beer. But I haven't included any of those because this survey is about all the prices. Bar, fine, lady, drink, short time, everything. So obviously I can't include that first category. So then you've got the traditional beer bars, which do have work, uh, working girls. Yeah, like Ammon's new bar, which we've just been to, and also like David's Backyard Bar which we're going to come into now and this is this is it on the right here we're going to go and say hello to david he'll give you his prices he'll tell you himself hi <laughs> hello there hi i'm doing a, a another video yeah and this video has to look for bar prices yeah yeah yeah, yeah beer price uh yeah your Chang Leo Singha My Beer 70 baht. 70. 70. Okay. Um, San Miguel Heineken uh, 80 baht. And what about soda and coke and soft drink generally? Uh, ranges between 40 and 50 baht. Okay. And then water 30 baht. Uh, lady drink. Lady drink 150. Well, well, same as everybody, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, and bar fine? Yeah. After, after 9 o'clock, 500. Uh, okay. If you don't just want to take them out to dinner, some for an hour or so, yeah. like any time of the day, 300. Oh, really? Only 300 yeah. for like a short time? Yeah, for yeah, yeah. Right, if you live very near. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, but literally, yeah. like yesterday I had a guy, really, he came and he took the girl out for dinner for right. one uh, okay. hour, hour and a half, so. Right, right, right. right. Uh, 300. Now, you heard what David said. Uh, this type of bar, like his and Ammon's bar, are good value. Not only for the beer, but for the low bar farm or room rate prices. You know, which are very similar to the prices over the last few years. They've not really put them up, have they? Um, and also the low ST and LT prices. So, they do exist, these places. Um, we'll go and check a few more now, okay? We're in, uh, this is Tree Town. So we're going to go and check uh, the, the bars on the left side. We'll pick, I'll pick one of them, I think uh, probably the Joy Bar. We'll go have a look there and we'll have a, have a chat and we'll check out the prices there, see what they're like. you uh, some prices. Uh, how much is beer here? This beer 80 baht. 80 baht for Chang or Leo? Uh, yeah, it's 80 baht. It makes a difference all the time. Okay. And how much is your lady drink here? You have lady drink? Yeah. You have lady work here? You have lady drink here? How much is lady drink? Uh, 150. 150. 
Okay, and how much is your bar fine? 400 bar. For a short time, one time, just 400. Okay. Thank you. So the prices there are reasonable, like the beer, uh, the soda, lady drinks, and the bar fine. And I did check later the ST prices. They're all reasonable, just like they used to be and still staying traditional. Now then, the next place we're going to look at is Scooter's Bar. Okay, now I checked those prices, and again, the beer prices are good, the soda prices are good, or the soft drink prices. Uh, lady drink prices are good. What's not so good is that the bar fine's starting to creep up uh, as you get into the uh, uh, certain certain groups of of bars where they have to pay more for the girls. The path bar fines are going up. That's what's happening. So let's go and have a look at uh, another one which is just recently opened called Mayfair. It used to be Zero Bar, but they left and went up the road. Uh, and now Mayfair has taken over. Uh, so again, um, those prices are reasonable. Um, we've got beer at uh, at 70 baht. We've got soda at 60 baht. Lady drinks a little bit higher at 160, but not much. And then your bar fine is 500. So we're just coming off Bacow slightly. This is soy linky going up toward third road so I'm just going to randomly choose any bar on the left side here there's a, there's a few of them in a row uh, I'll just choose one and walk in and check the prices uh, and I'll choose that one that we do on Jai bar we'll, I'll go in there I'll just check the prices in there well that's a pleasant surprise isn't it that's like the old days the prices from the old days eh that's very cheap Probably because it's it's not on Bacow, it's off Bacow, so uh, they're sticking to the older prices. So now we've come down Sardana. I've walked right to the bottom of Sardana, and these are the diner bars. These are the, the original old ones that have been there for donkey's years, you know. So I'm going to just wander into one, a couple of these and check the prices, uh, and I'll put them up on the screen right now. Not that cheap, really, is it? Um, you know, 80 baht a beer's pushing it a bit, I think, for a little complex like this. Lady drinks, we're up there at 150. The only thing that's really cheap is the bar fine at 300. I um, think that's a little bit on the on the higher price. I think it uh, overpriced slightly. That, that's what I think. That. Okay, let's go and have a look somewhere else, shall we? Okay, so now we're down on uh, Bukau 15, that's the hideaway there, which you, is a good place for to eat breakfast. Uh, and we're going to walk down Soy 15 here. Um, Grand Avenue is just down here on the left. So um, I'm going to show you the difference between the traditional type beer bar and the new type of beer bar, which is all about image and having a whole bunch of very attractive girls on show uh, who are all being paid very high salaries and what is the direct result of those high salaries? Well the bar has to get that thousand bar high salary back uh, and what happens is that gets passed on to the customer in the form of a high bar fine. The reason for the high bar fine is that the bar does not want the girls bar fine. Uh, they want them to spend the time selling drinks and guys just getting lady drinks and lady drinks and lady drinks all night long. That's what the object is. Okay, so now we're down at the bottom of Soy Bacow uh, where that new market is and up there is Soy is Benelux bar. It's quite well known Benelux, has lots of girls outside usually uh, and their prices are as follows uh, it's quite a busy bar now we're going to move on to new plaza bars which traditionally uh, is soy cheap Charlie if you like um, they're cheaper than most bars as a rule so that's why I came here uh, at the end just to show you 
Um, in fact, their prices are reasonable, but not any cheaper than um, a couple of some of the other ones I've shown. So we'll have a little look around. Um, now, we're just going back to what we were talking about before, about the, the new type of, of beer bars which are around. Let me just go through a couple of things with you. Now, in my opinion, the reason that single guys come to Patia is not to sit in a bar full of pretty girls and buy lady drinks all night. That's not what they come for, in my opinion. Uh, it's usually to buy one or two lady drinks to establish if there's any chemistry and in, then if there is, to pay the bar fine. And that's what most people have done for years. Uh, now, this new idea of having a, a huge bar fine uh, as a deterrent, in my opinion, would only work once, and then I would never go back to that particular bar. I would choose a bar which has a reasonable bar fine. But that's just me. Some beer bars still run on the philosophy of providing attractive staff who are happy to be bar fined at a reasonable price, between 300 and 500 baht. Uh, and these bars have happy, satisfied customers who will return again and again. Anyway, guys, um, thank you for watching. And please subscribe and like and share and ring the bell. And I shall see you on the next video.